Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Mike3Rs DIY. In this video, I'm going to show you something very important that you need to consider before you buy any smart uh, thermostat, especially the Ecobee 4. So as you can see here uh, in that, this diagram, these are the wires required for the Ecobee 4. And I think for some other thermostat is pretty much the same because they are designed for central air like uh, systems. So if you have a boiler that only for the heat, if you only have the heat as I have in my house uh, and you have this kind of thermostat, it's gonna come with these two wires. One is, you know, the, the voltage going in, which is the red one. And then the other one is, uh, the white one is going down to the boiler. So this is, uh, you know, thermostats, they work as a switch. So every time you reach that temperature, uh, the set temperature, it opens the switches. When it goes below that temperature, it closes that switch. So you can see here uh, the, the W and the RC. That's all I have on, on my boiler. I recommend that you, you do what I did to the thermostat that you currently have. So you just open it, you know, uh, and you're gonna have this plate and see how many wires do you have and which one are they. Basically what you need is another wire that's gonna power the thermostat, the Eco before. So uh, like right now you have the, the red one and you need a common wire, which is what I'm gonna show you in the next video. Uh, I'm gonna show you how I pull the wire and I how I wired the whole uh, thermostat and how it started working and I love all the functions it has. So don't forget to subscribe, like the video, comment if I'm missing anything, uh, and thank you for watching.